As a homeowner with a 3% fixed rate mortgage, Eleanor Hernley empathizes with anyone who has an arm that's about to reset. I bought my first house when I was 24. Hernley's monthly house payments, not including insurance and taxes, will be the same for the life of her loan. I feel really lucky to be where I'm at. Homeowners with an adjustable rate mortgage or ARM can lock in a low rate for usually five or seven years, but eventually the ARM will reset. If the adjustment happens during the kind of high interest rate environment we're currently in, it could add hundreds of dollars to a homeowner's monthly mortgage payment. Right, we knew these interest rate spikes were coming. Michael Jones, an economics professor at UC, says any kind of loan with a variable interest rate, including arms, could be impacted by recent moves at the Federal Reserve. The Fed has uh, announced this for quite a few months to expect the, uh, the interest rate rise. And it's not just homes, it's credit cards, it's student loans. And so if you have any of those other types of loans that are based on a, a variable interest rates, really be paying attention to that right now. Fortunately, homeowners with solid credit who are facing loan adjustments soon can often refinance into a new arm with a rate typically lower than current fixed rates. So while their monthly payments may go up, the rise doesn't have to involve a case of sticker shock. Hernley hopes homeowners with adjustable mortgages understand how their loans work and how to avoid falling off a financial cliff. The more education that we have, the more open that especially lenders are with what they're actually giving to their customers, the better. Now, if you're a homeowner with an adjustable rate mortgage, it is important to dust it off and make sure you know when it's scheduled to reset. Ideally, you can refinance into a new arm with a reasonable rate, or if variable rates are keeping you up at night, you may want to consider a loan with a fixed rate. Todd Dykes, WWT News 5.